All right, so we're shooting a video series on um, functional medicine and how it may not work for some people, or if you've gone through a functional medicine program and have not gotten the results that you were looking for, this could be why. We've talked about the brain and how important that is. We've talked about the structural function and how important that is. So the next part I want to talk about is supplementation. It's very important. In our society, we are very much looking for the quick fix. We're very much looking for the thing that is going to make us feel better immediately. Um, in that effort, a lot of times we look to control what the body is trying to do. We use supplements even that control and stimulate the body and make the body get certain results that we're looking for. And I think, in my opinion, that is a mistake. I feel like our, our goal should not be to, to force the body into a given response. I think our, body should be to, or our goal should be to support the body, to rebuild the parts of the body that are weak so that the body can carry out what it's supposed to do on its own. That way you're not dependent on supplements for the rest of your life. So let's give the example of the adrenal glands. You have an adrenal, uh, a fatigued adrenal gland, and I have an adrenal supplement. I give you a supplement that's designed to stimulate your adrenal glands, so it gets your, your glands, and they're, they're fatiguing, so that's why you need something in the first place, because they're tired. So I give you a supplement that stimulates your adrenal glands, and you feel a little better. But they get weaker, because they've been stimulated, they haven't been strengthened. So it takes more supplement to get that same response. Then they get weaker, it takes more supplement. They get weaker, and eventually you get to the point where you're taking so much supplement, and it's not working, and all you have left is a fatigued adrenal gland. Now the other option is what's called whole food supplementation where you're feeding the gland. So I give you a whole food supplement to feed this tired adrenal gland. When I give you this supplement, you don't feel better because I'm not stimulating this gland. I'm not forcing it to work. But I keep giving you the supplement and we keep feeding the gland. And eventually the gland starts to do better and it gets stronger. And then all of a sudden you start feeling better. But it's not because of the supplements, it's because you have a gland that's working. You keep on doing the supplement until the gland support and, and rebuilds itself and is able to carry out the functions that it's supposed to, and then you can take the supplement away and you've got a functioning gland or organ. So in this process, we use whole food supplementation because we want to support the normal function. We want to support the healing of these systems that have gone weak so that the body can carry out the functions. So in my opinion, whole food supplementation is critical and there are very few functional medicine doctors that use whole food supplementation because they're trying to quickly manipulate lab results to make sure that they're getting the results that they want. Sometimes it might take us 90 days to 100, 180 days to get the change in the labs that we're looking for because we're trying to help support normal body function. We're not trying to manipulate and cause a function or a lab change. If you support normal body function, the labs will change as the body heals. The weight will come off as the body heals, but that's in supporting normal function. We're not going in and trying to manipulate. We're try not trying to tr treat a disease. We're trying to support the body in its healing processes. So that is critical, and that is a huge difference when you're looking at functional me uh, medicine protocols. And the doctors that you're looking at, you need to make sure that they implement that. All right, I hope that makes sense. Please feel free to subscribe to our channel on YouTube um, and like us on Facebook to get more of these videos.